Scorpio. So before I get started, I would like to give a thank you to everyone who has joined my Patreon and have gained access to my daily readings. Also to everyone who has went and checked out my lashes, jslashes.com. Anything you need will be in the description bar. The link to my personal readings website, also the link to my vlog channel is down below as well. Universe, what is the energy surrounding Scorpio? Okay. All right, so we have the judgment card here. When I think of judgment, it makes me feel that you are going to have to make a decision about something. So it almost makes me feel like you could be getting some information that makes you maybe want to change your mind about something, whether it's information about a job, information about a person. But I do feel like you're going to be faced with a very important decision. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Libra. Okay, yeah, Eight of Swords. I feel like not knowing what to do in a situation. We do have this star card energy here. So I almost feel that you could have an opportunity coming your way or you could be wanting to do something something that you've always wanted to do uh the star and the knight of cups these are both cards of wishes <clears throat> and with the star card energy it makes me feel like you have a talent that you may want to go for like i don't know it seems like you're going to go audition for something and you're not sure if you should or something like that for some reason i feel that fear could be holding you back from doing something and i feel that um, the advice is to do it anyway because you're going to get great results from it. So, and of course, it could be anything, starting a business, going back to school, um, whatever it is that maybe you're just a little unsure about doing. I feel like advice is just to go ahead and do it anyway. Okay. Yeah, we have the Five of Pentacles here and the Two of Swords. So I do feel like you, this could be a significant other or a family member or something. You could be fighting about something. Five of Pentacles here could be about finances. Um, fighting about finances, fighting about the home. Or maybe you guys disagree on something. What is the energy? Is it okay, I just flew across the room. <clears throat> okay, for some reason I'm getting that maybe your significant other is like, oh, maybe it's not the right time to do this, but I feel like you... You feel differently. Could be done with the Capricorn. We did a devil card here or a Sagittarius. Um, but I feel like advice here is to do it. Because I see you being successful, like very successful, whatever this is. Maybe you would have to move away from them. Or for some reason, they're against you doing this. And maybe you'll be gone for a while. Say, so why is the devil card energy here? The devil card, this is... I don't know, this definitely could be self-sabotage um, or just sabotage in general. But just looking at the picture of this card, like, I don't know. I feel like somebody's trying to keep you close or keep you in a cage. Could be done with a fire sign. We have the Queen of Wands here at the bottom of the deck. Aries Leo Sag. What is the energy surrounding the devil? What is the energy surrounding the devil? Okay, Nine of Pentacles with the Fool. Yeah, I feel like this person, I don't know, I feel like they believe in you, but maybe they just don't want you to do it, or maybe they feel as if, if you did this, everything would be on this person, like they would have to take care of everything, but I don't feel like that's going to be the case at all, but I feel this is what they're thinking. Somebody could want a child as well. We do have the Sun card here at the bottom of the deck. Somebody wants to start a family. Maybe that's something that you guys disagree on maybe somebody wants to start a family right now and the other doesn't why is the two of swords here okay yeah queen of cups and the four of cups yeah somebody is i feel like somebody is just take okay i will say this i feel that either your person or your family member your friend is taking out their sadness on you like I don't know I'm just feeling a lot of sadness surrounding this and I almost feel that this is not your energy like I don't know I'm just looking at these cards everyone in these pictures look fucking sad and I almost feel that you may know a solution to help or how how to help and maybe this person is just not wanting you to do it I almost feel that this person wants to stay stuck your person wants to stay stuck whoever this is or you could be trying to help someone but they really just want to it's like they don't want to do anything about it. They don't want to take the action to actually heal themselves. Like I really, I mean, this could be your energy, but I'm really feeling this is somebody that you're dealing with. The fact that we have uh, people fighting about it, I feel like this is not your energy. But. Hmm. 
Why is the Five of Cups here? Okay. Ooh. Yikes. Okay. So I'm also getting somebody regrets dealing with a third party. So I don't know if this maybe happened um, in the past and like maybe you forgave this person or they forgave you, whatever happened here. Um, but I feel like this is this fight keeps resurfacing. So maybe your person keeps bringing it up. And you, they, they, it seems like they can't move forward from it. Whether this is you or them, they can't move forward from it. I feel like it's keeping you guys stuck or just keeping this person stuck. So, give me more on the Three of Cups energy. Oh, yeah. Six, yeah, ooh. Six of Cups with the Five of Swords. Okay, I'm also getting another message. Somebody's past, somebody's ex, somebody's ex-friend, whatever. Um, I feel like they're intentionally trying to sabotage your relationship. So definitely be aware of that. But yeah, I'm getting that somebody can't let some go. Like they just cannot let it go. Why is the Five of Swords here? And I'm almost feeling that either you or your person are just going to have to make a decision like judgment. This is a very important decision. So it's like, if somebody can't let go of what happened in the past, like I feel like you're going to decide to leave or decide to walk away because I really feel that the relationship can't progress. If this person cannot, it's like they say they forgive you or you say you forgive them and you don't, or they don't. And it like just keeps you guys stagnant, keeps you guys fighting whatever yeah. Anyways, what are the messages for Scorpio what are the messages for Scorpio yeah I feel like the, the advice here is to try to find a solution to this like and I do feel for some reason I'm getting that you could have been with this person for a while it could be an earth sign we do have the Queen of Pentacles here, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You could have been with this person for quite some time. So it's like you don't just want to let go of the situation. But I definitely feel, um, especially with the Star card and Temperance, healing must happen. Like there has to be some forward movement or the relationship or this friendship is just not going to work. Honestly, though, I do not see your person letting go of this. If this is the if this is your reading and this is your message, I do not see your person letting go of this. It's almost yeah, I don't see it happening, or at least not for a while. I don't think they're gonna let go. It's almost like I feel someone stuck in their own head, like very much so stuck in their own head. Neighbors, what is the advice? What is the advice? Okay, so we do have the page of fire here. That makes me feel like that there is a solution, that there can be um, a resolution to this. But I do feel like it's going to take some sort of action on your guys' part, whether this is getting counseling or, you know, really having a heart to heart, whatever it may be. I do feel like there needs to be some action um, that needs to be taken regarding the situation because I like I said I feel like this has been if this is your message I feel like this has been a long-term relationship somebody fucked up somebody wants to forgive them but it's like they can't let it go I feel like some counseling or something like that needs to happen here but I do feel with the strength card energy that and I don't get to say this often but I do feel with the strength card energy you got your guys's bond is strong enough to get through it but I just feel like you can need a little bit of help with that so I do hope that this reading was helpful for you. If you would like a personal reading, you can visit my website at swordstarot.com. And hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day.